Alright guys, here's a wrap up of the day's finds. I uh, haven't been out for a few weeks and I was really itching to get out and I finally got out today and I uh, had a pretty good day. So uh, here's some of the junk that I got. Uh, pop tops, uh, Bic lighter, just general trash that you come across, uh, some lead. Right here I found a non-silver spoon, stainless steel. Uh, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten pennies, a couple dimes, and a quarter. I got a dollar bill, which is cool. Uh, good tip, if you see cash in the water, you might want to look around, because rarely is it just a single note that you find. Um, but I did look around today. I went upstream and downstream further, and it, unfortunately didn't see any other cash, so it was just a single note. Uh, the better finds, I uh, found this cool ring. It has a maker's mark in it, but it doesn't say if it's sterling silver or not, or pewter. But it's looking very much like sterling silver. Could be a homemade thing or something. I'm not sure. The stone could be CZ. Is it focusing? I mean, it'd be cool if it's a real diamond, but I, I doubt it. I'll be able to test it later. Um, I found it in an area where I found some other antique jewelry before so this could be a piece of old antique that could even be like a lead glass stone in there uh, which used to be done a long time ago and I found rings like that have those kind of stones in it too so I'll take it home and test it and let you guys know uh, the cool find today is these this pair of Burberry sunglasses which I thought is pretty awesome I don't know much about Burberry I know it's it can be a more pricey brand uh, the nose pad's bent a little bit, but I think I could fix that, and they're, it's a bit rough around the edges, but I think I'd be able to clean these up pretty good. They're polarized. Um, so yeah, I mean, this is, this is pretty sweet. I think I might be able to clean those up. I've actually lost a pair of nice sunglasses this year, uh, so this might make up for it. We'll see how it fits and everything. I'll clean them up and let you guys see. So, anyways, yeah, it was good to finally get out after three or four weeks. Today, uh, first time of the year, needing my wetsuit. So, it's that time of year, I'm going to have to wear the wetsuit over the winter and everything like that, but it's still fun to get out. Alright guys, uh, I'll catch up with you guys soon. See ya.